Hey guys, today I'm doing a chit chat get ready with me video. Um, sorry if there's some weird light patches on my body. I am sitting in front of my window and I have Italian blinds and I can't help this. <laughs> so today I'm thinking of doing a less neutral look, like just a slight departure from neutral and doing a more green uh, eye look and we'll just see what happens. I haven't practiced anything. I literally just woke up at like 11.30 because I worked night shift last night and I needed my beauty sleep. So let's get started. First I'm going to use the uh, Wet n Wild Photo Focus Eyeshadow Primer. Looks like this. And we're just going to prime the eyelids. Today I am off from work and I'm actually going to see Cirque du Soleil, which is like a circus performance troupe that tours around Canada and I don't know if they tour in the States. but um. I used to watch them on TV all the time as a kid and I've never seen them live so I'm really excited to uh, go see them in the actual giant tent that they do their performance in. This uh, series they're doing is called Curios with a K <laughs> and I will report back to you how it was but I'm very excited to see it. So I'm going to be using the Wet n Wild Comfort Zone palette, sorry about that glare, and I'm going to be using this green shade for my inner half of my eyelid. Some of you may know that I had been participating in Inktober, keyword had. I thought I could do it. I thought I had the resolve, the determination, but I'm a lazy piece of poo. And I stopped on day 13. It's actually quite hard to make time to draw every day, um, something that you're proud of. Honestly, I could have done it if I did like a quick five minute doodle and I'm sure that's still fine because the whole goal of Inktober is just to like get into good drawing habits where you draw every day and you know, practice your inking skills, but I don't know. I just found I wasn't satisfied with some of my pieces when I didn't have time to really work on them. And I'm a lazy piece too. Let's not forget that. So I gave up. Yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> but if you like, I can link here um, the two videos that I did film for Inktober. I did one of a witch sitting on her broom, and I did another of a uh, mermaid, a uh, naked naked mermaid. So you can't watch it if you're under 18. Sorry. My hair is very messed up. I have bedhead for sure, and I cannot fix my bangs for the life of me, so I am sorry. Just ignore it. All right. Now I'm going to use the Kat Von D Metal Matte Palette from last year's holiday collection. This still is so cool. Look, matte. Metal. And I'm going to be using this dark green color called Moss. And I'll be putting it on the outer edge of my eyelid. I may return to doing some traditional artwork, but I don't know. I just don't want to be burdened by that. I have to draw every day. I know it's so... It's, so, it's such a cop-out, but... So I tried English breakfast tea for the first time by recommendation of a very good friend of mine. And I don't understand. It tastes almost like orange pico, but it's like a sad version of orange pico. And I quite like orange pico tea. And I usually take my tea with um, just some sugar and milk. I don't know, it just tastes like the hollow husk of a orange pico tea. Sorry, I'm just putting that dark green eyeshadow on the bottom half of my lower eyelid as well. I know it looks a little crazy right now, but we're gonna blend it out, so don't worry. So now I'm gonna be using this um, flat, fluffy kind of eyeshadow brush, and I'm gonna be dipping into Bone in the Metal Matte Palette, which is this matte eyebrow highlight shade, and just be blending out the top, like so. Like, I have a cup of English breakfast in here. Do you like my mug? It says pumpkin. It's so festive, right? Like it's good, but it's definitely not orange pico. Let me know what your guys' thoughts are on English breakfast tea. It's uh, you know, it's not the bee's knees to, to me. I'm sorry if I've offended anyone, but more English breakfast tea for you then I guess. Of course I'm gonna be finishing the tea I bought, but again, I think my favorite tea goes 
like Western style tea goes in order of orange pico, Earl Grey, and then English breakfast. Okay, we looking a little cray. We looking a little cray, but that's okay. Now we're gonna add eyeliner to make this look a little less like a, oh my God, her eyes are green. I'm gonna be using the Heroine Make Smooth Liquid Eyeliner. It's waterproof. This guy. My parents actually got this for me in Hong Kong when they went on vacation because buying it here is hella expensive. And they also got me my favorite mascara, which is the Heroine Make a Long and Curl Mascara. It works really well on my short Asian lashes. So right now I'm just kind of drawing the initial line and oh my god, eyeliner on my eyeshadow poo. It's okay, it's okay. We can fix this. Anyway, I was saying, I'm just adding the initial line and uh, tight lining as well because one of my pet peeves is when people do their eyeliner and there's a gap between their eyelash like you know like the skin where your eyelash grows out oh that's so weird I'm sorry but <laughs> and um, the actual eyeliner you put on why is my hair like this so let's not let's not make that faux pas let's just do a good job and then I'll do the wing after it's gonna be Halloween on Tuesday which is what like three days from now no Today is not my day. Have you seen this? Have you seen that? <sighs> Let's get Okay, I'm back. <laughs> All I did was fix my eyeliner, just remove it with some um, makeup remover, and uh, re-intensify the inner corner from the Wet n Wild green eyeshadow there. Okay, let's hope for no more mishaps. As I was saying, Halloween is coming. And um, I would love to go to a Halloween party. I would love to dress up. But unfortunately, I'm working through Halloween night. I am a nurse, so dressing up might not be the greatest idea for patients, or especially that are confused. They might be a little scared to see someone dressed up. But there is a nurse I knew. <clears throat> she was an eggplant one year for Halloween. She wore purple scrubs and she had like a green hat that looked like leaves on her head. And I thought that was really creative without going like too crazy. But uh, I think I'm just gonna be safe and not dress up at work because I don't know if that's okay with my manager. <laughs> okay, now I'm doing the wing. My hands are not super steady, but uh, I kind of want this wing to be pretty can cut you if you get too close to me. This eyeliner is really good. Like it's so easy to apply. I mean liquid eyeliner is probably the hardest style of eyeliner to apply but what I mean is that it glides on so smoothly and it's so pigmented. Some other liquid eyeliners I have is um ah is a uh, this one, it's the Essence Super Fine Eyeliner Pen. It's the waterproof version. And the product is nice, but after you like have been working with it for a couple minutes, it starts, the tip starts to dry out. I think because it's such a long tip. Like, can you see that? It's so long. So the very edge, like the very, very tip runs out of ink and then you're, uh, you're screwed. Yep. Let's do some mascara. Today, I'm gonna be using the L'Oreal Lash L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise uh, Mascara in Waterproof. It's the dupe um, for Better Than Sex from Too Faced. Let's just coat those lashes. Attractive face. So it's starting to get colder now where I live. It's actually quite warm this morning. Like I'm wearing like a tank top style top because I just can't film in front of my window in the sun without sweating. And um, because it's getting colder, even though right now it's not that cold, my car, did I tell you I have a new car? Because I do. His name's Arnie, here's a picture of him. He's a 2012 Honda Civic LX. He is my baby. Well, his name's Arnold, but I call him Arnie for short. And you're probably like, 
Why Arnold? That's not a name for a car. That's like a name for the kid from Magic School Bus. Well, when I was a, well, it, his name is kind of like an inside joke for my family. When I was little, I used to watch this Smurfs cartoon, and there's this one, I vividly remember this one episode with a shark named Arnold in it. And then we were having crab that night, and I remember my parents brought it home, and I was like, oh, your name Arnold, your name Arnold, your name Arnold, and I was like naming everything Arnold, so that's the joke. I'm naming everything Arnold, because I used to do it as a child. Anyway, I was saying, I got a squeegee for my car, because when I have to drive home after work in the morning, it is hella hard to wait in the parking lot for like five minutes plus for your windows to defrost. And I'm an impatient lady and I wanna go home after work. So, I bought a squeegee to speed up defrost time. I bought it from Canadian Tire. It was almost $7. And I think that's kind of a ripoff. But now I have it. Oh, sorry, that was primer. My usual, hard candy, sheer envy. Okay, let's do foundation. Today I'm gonna use the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Foundation. This feather. My skin's been not too terrible lately. It's mostly just I've been breaking it on my chin. Oh boy, light's moving. Okay, let's just keep going. So I'm gonna be adding concealer next. I'm gonna use the Rimmel Match Perfection um, Concealer in light. I'm just gonna put it where I wanna put a little more coverage. I quite like this concealer. One night I was very upset and um, I was crying a lot and then I woke up and my eyes were super gross and dark and puffy. But this concealer hit it all, no one could tell. Or at least no one like asked me, oh hey, why do you look like a panda? Because this concealer can hide sadness. <laughs> All right, let me blend that out. And I use the same brush to blend out the foundation. Sorry, I did that off camera. And I just use a finger to do the details. Let's just set that with some powder. I'm gonna be using the Wet n Wild Contouring Palette. And I'm just going to be using the highlighting side. It's not really a highlight, it's just like a matte, light colored powder, but like the color is almost not present. So I just use it as like a setting powder for liquid stuff. Good. Fish. And then I'm going to be using the dark side, which I've hit pan on! And the same paddle brush, and I'm just going to contour my jawline. look like I'm not fatty. Here we go. I've been thinking of doing a lipstick collection video on this channel because I have so many lip products and I realize I like rarely use lip products because I don't know like usually my eyes are the star of my look and then if I add a lip color too I often feel like I look too done up or like a clown. There we go. Let's add some blush too. So maybe I'll do like a lip product collection and declutter, maybe. Because I have too many and I don't use more. So I'm going to be using the Maybelline Fit Me blush in uh, medium pink. This blush is not very pigmented, but it adds like a nice tint of rosiness to the cheeks. My cheeks are already pretty rosy naturally, so it's okay if it's not like boom, bam, in your face pink. Good enough. You can barely tell, but it's there. And let's do some highlight. I'm going to be using the NYX Highlight and Contouring Pro Palette. I got this on sale for like 18 bucks at Shoppers Drug Mart, so I'm very proud of myself. <laughs> and I'm going to be using this light highlight shade with some shimmer in it. I'm just applying it with my finger. Oh, look at that. Tip of the nose, bridge of the nose, cheekbones, of course. Keep it 
bow and chin. There. Looks good. We're gonna set everything with setting spray. I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild Photo Focus setting spray. This is super inexpensive and super good. I look wet right now, but it'll dry down. And that's that. Thanks for watching my casual get ready with me video. Um, probably insert some pictures of what the look looks like here. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I will fix my bangs. <laughs> And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. And if you would subscribe to my channel, I would love to have you here. So I hope to see you again. Thanks. Bye-bye.